More on the riots, folks. The riots, the looting, the cowards and all of that palaver. Listen, they're still arresting people and it's good to see. Really good to see. It needs to stop. Maybe it has stopped. I think they've done enough. Or I think they're doing enough. They've acted decisively, which is unlike any government we've seen over the last 10 or 20 years. It's about time somebody got something right. Do I support Labour? No. Do I like Starmer? No, not at all. Do I think he's got this one right? Absolutely spot on. I've already said that. But what I really liked about the arrest over the last couple of days, they've arrested a good few folk, but I noticed yesterday they'd arrested two Asians as well. The Asians panned the facing of a couple of white people, and they also got arrested, and they're also doing time. Spot on. I noticed uh, on the internet today, you've seen three or four women be arrested. Spot on. I think that's great. Because I've seen some of these pictures where women are getting involved as well. And I don't care whether they're women or not. They shouldn't be doing it neither. If they've done wrong, they also get arrested. That tells women they're not going to get a pass. The same way it tells the Asian folk, they're not going to get a pass. I like it. Carry it on. Carry it on until the riots stop. Well done. Bit disappointed with this bird from Cheshire. I shouldn't say bird. No, I shouldn't. I'm, I'm being derogatory, but it's because I don't like her, although I don't know her. The, the one that tweeted who the, the killer was in Southport, you know, uh, or retweeted. She's a millionaire, they say, lives in Chester there in a lovely little mansion. She's one of these conspiracy theorists, not for the jab, not for lockdown, not for anything, doesn't like to conform. She got arrested for the tweet, I thought, spot on, great. She's since been bailed, bit disappointing. Is money talking? I hope not. Some might say, well, she didn't put nasty things online. She just retweeted something, but still, it helped to flame the fans. Fan the flames, flame the fans. The fans and flamflinger, what's that got to do with it? Nothing to do with it at all. This is serious, this. She helped to fan the flames, and for that, she should get into some trouble as well. Uh, let's see what becomes of that. I'd hate to think just because she's got a few quid, she's bought her way out of things. Anyway, we'll see. The next few days will tell us more.